Hello all. In this video, I am going to show how to use PubChem Sketcher to draw chemical structures and how to use UCSF Chimera to visualize 3D structures. So let's start. So for PubChem Sketcher, we have to simply type PubChem Sketcher. in the Google search bar and then this will you give the top result PubChem Sketcher version 2.4 so you have to simply click on this and this is the interface of PubChem Sketcher version 2.4 so here are different options uh, which will assist in drawing chemical structures and this is the drawing area where we will draw the structure so if you want to draw benzene ring then you have to simply click here on this benzene ring and then place the cursor in the drawing area and simply click so you will get the benzene ring in order to add hydrogens we have to select add and then click on the we have to click on the hydrogens hydrogen button so you can see this benzene ring with all six hydrogens and you can see also the alternate single and double bonds and here is the smiles notation of benzene ring so smiles stand for simplified molecular input line entry system so this is very simple uh, notation for small molecules and uh, this uh, this format is uh, this notation can be accepted by many molecular mo modeling programs and you can uh, we can use this smiles notation to get the 3d structure of the, of any small molecule so if you want to export this structure if you want to save this structure you can click on export here so by default mdl mole file option is here so when you will click on export then it will export in the sdf format so if we click on export here then it's a uh, it will give you a sketcher dot sdf so i have downloaded it multiple times that's why multiple times that's why it's a uh, it is here so when you will do uh, when you will export only one uh, so it will give you sketcher.sdf you can also change the format so smiles notation you can export as sketcher.smi so this is a sketcher.smi so let me open this sketcher.smi in the notepad and you can see this smiles notation here so now we are going to use uh, ucsf chimera to visualize this benzene ring so for this i am going to use uh, the latest version of chimera so this is 1.15 and in order to use the smile notation smiles notation we have to click on tools menu then go to the structure editing then click on build structure and you have to check this radio button smile string and we have to first copy this smile note, smiles notation and then control v will paste the smiles notation of engineering in this area and then simply click on apply so after that you will get this engineering 
and you can rotate, you can also translate it. You can zoom it, you can zoom in, you can zoom out. And if you want to save this structure, then simply go to File, then save PDB, and you can save it as benjin.pdb. So simply you have to write benjin and the .pdb extension will be automatically added. So I'm going to overwrite this structure. So simply benjin.pdb will get over. So it will re overwrite this file. Yeah. If you want to save it as mole2, then save mole2. Then we have benjin. And you don't have to put the dot mold to extension, it will automatically add. Then click on save. So now uh, in that uh, in folder, we have benjin.pdb and benjin.mold. So we are going to close this session and we are going to use uh, we are going to draw another small molecule. So let's draw the structure of aspirin. So aspirin is an, an anti-inflammatory drug. So it is used to, it's a medication which is used to reduce pain, fever on inflammation. And chemical structure of aspirin is like this. So we have acetoxy group here and we have acid group here. So this is actually acetyl group um, COCS3 and here is oxygen. So this complete group is acetoxic. Um, so it is also called acetyl salicylic acid because here is the acetyl group and this rest structure is salicylic acid. So this is called acetyl salicylic acid. So we are going to draw this aspirin using the chem, pub chem uh, sketcher. So first of all, uh, first of all, we have to delete this benzene ring here. So simply select the delete and then click on bonds and atoms. So now this drawing area is clean, is empty. So we are again, uh, uh, as we see that aspirin has benzene ring. So this benzene ring we have to draw and then we will draw the acid and then acetoxic group. So first draw this benzene ring here. Then we are going to draw the acid group. So for acid group, it's a C COS group. So for double bond, yeah. Okay, so we need oxygen. So for that, you have to click here on oxygen and then click here O. So this is CO group. So when we will add hydrogens, then the hydrogen will be added here. So uh, we have to then uh, draw the acetoxy group. So for acetoxy group, O, so here oxygen, and then acetyl group. So acetyl group is COCS3.
and automatically here it is by default it's a CS3. So if you you will draw any structure by automatically it's a carbon here. Okay, so you have to select the element atom and then you can add it that. And then we can so this is this 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 structure is now lacking hydrogen. It, uh, so we have to add hydrogens. So this is aspirin molecule. So this is a structure of aspirin, O, CO, CH3, and then acid group. And we see that here, uh, smiles notation doesn't have hydrogens. So now the hydrogens are here. So we are going to copy this smile notation or simply we can export it as a smile. And then using the same dialog here, we are going to paste it, control V and then apply. So now we see that this is the 3D structure of aspirin. So one thing which we missed here is clean the structure. So here it's a clean option will uh, optimize all the bonds and it will also correct the structure. So if we clean the structure and then uh, let me again copy this. I'm going to paste it again. So back a space. Control V. So don't forget to clean this area before you paste. So now so now we have this structure. You can see the 3D structure of aspirin now. And you can save this structure as save PDB. So aspirin.pdb or you can so basically it is telling that you must provide a file name so aspirin.pdb if we save it as you must provide the file name that either name or number so um, So it is showing that I have two structures in this window. So I'm going to delete one. So if you have two structures, then you can delete one and you can save them. Or either you can select from here also. So this will save as aspirin.pdb. If you want to save it as say mole2, um, as mole2, then you have to simply aspirin, uh, write aspirin here. The mole2 will be automatically added. Dot mole2 will be automatically added. So now, so I have now pdb and mole2 files for this aspirin. And you can rotate, you can zoom in, zoom out this structure. So this is the 3D structure of SPD. So, um, so really PubChem Sketcher is very uh, user friendly online tool to draw chemical structures. And then we can use the smiles to get the 3D structure.
using UCSF Chimera. So thank you all for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe the YouTube channel. Thank you very much.